and welcome to today's video. So finally today I am finally recording my hair expo haul for you guys. I know a few people have been asking me when is this coming out. Well it's coming out now okay. So here is my hair expo haul for 2017. Um, as you guys know I went to hair expo in Sydney um, which was last month. Um, so yeah I will show you everything that I got given and what I bought and all the exciting things. I am missing one of the things that I bought from there because it's still at the salon and I completely forgot to bring it home with me. So um, I'll tell you about that later on in this in this video. Um, but the first thing I got given, I went to a store called Foil Republic and I somehow ended up getting a sample of oil, all their foil. So um, all their different types of foil, from what I have read in the book, it's they have different thicknesses and things like that and different lengths and it's all pre, I think it's pre-cut foil, so if you're a hairdresser you know that this is what we use out and do all our hair foiling and stuff with. So I got some samples of that, I actually got two samples of these, but one I gave to my boss so she could try them out. So the next thing I got, um... I've got it all here on the floor, is I went to the Tangle Teaser um, stand. So I went to the Tangle Teaser stand because I do love Tangle Teasers. Um, they are my favourite brushes and I use them every day on my own hair. So I did actually get myself a new one. So this is what it looks like. It is the Ultimate by the Tangle Teaser. So that's a cool box. And this is what it looks like. So it's just a normal Tangle Teaser, but it's got a handle. And I really like this. They are so good for my hair, especially with my extensions, getting the knots out and things like that. I use this all the time. I use this every day. I've got one here and then I've got one in my handbag. And this is my second one now. My other ones actually have died because I had them for I had them for two years. So yeah, I got myself one of these and I think it was like $20 I think for this one and then I got um, I got another pack for my mum which she got one as well can't really 100% remember how much they were but it was around about the $20 mark and then from the same stand I also got some hair ties and they are by the brand Invisible so if you haven't heard of these it is the hair ties that look like a quill so this is what they look like here so I got the ones in power, which is their biggest size, because obviously having extensions, I need the thicker ones. So I got obviously hot pink and clear, and they, you can see them in the box, but this is just what they look like. So they stretch out. I love these hair ties, um, because for me, um, I don't like when you pop your hair up in a ponytail, or a bun, or anything like that, and... I'm just going to sit them on the bench. And you get those lines or you pull it out and it hat tangles or anything like that. These ones, they don't leave a, they don't leave an indentation mark. And they also don't pull and they are anti-breakage as well. So I, don't, I love these things. I have so many of them. Um, and the good thing about them is when you do re-stretch them, I found out the other day from watching YouTube, that you can make them go back to the original size by putting them in hot water makes them downsize so if you have these and you love them and you want to reuse them put them in hot water and they will shrink back to the original size so that is just a tip and I think these were about eleven dollars for the two packets so which is pretty good to me so the next stand that we went to was Di Lorenzo and this one I didn't actually purchase this was a freebie so it came like this and I obviously can't use this because of my extensions but this is from their new prescriptive solutions botanical range so this is what it looks like and you just pull the top off and then you've got some moisture balance shampoo so this is for normal to dry and colored hair it is sulfate and paraben free so it's a decent size um, a decent size sample and then you've got they have also given you 
a revive conditioner as well so I can't use these because they do have protein in them and being I have extensions you cannot use protein um, so I will keep these till probably when I don't have them in or if my mum she likes De Lorenzo so um, or I might give them to someone to try I'm not really sure yet but um, De Lorenzo is a really good brand so um, I really want to try this so I may even just keep them for myself but we'll see what happens so the next place we went to was actually the Evo slash Hair Australia um, stand. And if you have watched my vlog that I did over that weekend, you'll see that I actually met Guy, Guy Tang there. So he was at part at this stand and as of that we got, I got a little freebie. So that's what it looks like. It is the Evo, the Great Hydrator Moisture Mask. Um, so it says this product is like a patient friend gently combing out the knots in your hair while another friend lays petals and upon the ground to soften your walk to the morning bus i'm actually going to give this a go because i have been reading about it um and it doesn't have protein in it so i'm going to give this a go i'm actually going to use this next time i wash my hair because it's it's a treatment so you put it in it says here um put on wet hair leave on for five minutes and rinse so I'm going to give this a go. It was a little freebie that I got from Evo themselves while I was waiting to meet Guy Tang. So yeah, I'm definitely going to give that freebie a go. My cat is circling me because he's hungry. So the next place we went to was, um, I think it was like I Love Salon or something. And I went there, I've been there before. I think I went there last time I went and I did show you guys that I went there. So I got two things, one's hair related, one's not. I did get some spray bottles from there as well, which again aren't here because they're already at the salon. Um, so the first thing I got, which is hair related, is I got another one of these hair aid kits, which I did get, um, I'm gonna just sit it there. I did get one of these when I went to Expo a couple of years ago and I just literally ran out. So in this hair aid kit, as you can see on the back here, you get 29, if my camera will focus, you get 29 emergency hair accessories. So you get one headband, 20 bobby pins, four soft ties, and four hair ties. So your soft ties are obviously these ones here, and your hair ties are there. I like these soft hair ties. They're really good as well for non-snagging. Um, but yeah, I thought this is really cute. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this for myself because I did keep one in... I do have one from being in my handbag. Or I might gift it to someone. I'm not really sure yet. Um, I just think this is a really handy to have in my handbag. And it was literally like $10. So I grabbed another one of these. I did grab one for a friend of mine as well. So she's got that. And then the next thing I grabbed was this. And I was so surprised that they had it. And it is a Real Techniques um, Miracle Coverage Damp or Dry Beauty Blender. So as you can see, it's the one with the hard and then the pointy bit, which I've always wanted one of these ones um, because I want to try these because my Beauty Blender I've had for ages and it's just the normal Beauty Blender. So it's got the flat edge and the sides and the tip. And do you want to know, I was surprised. I went and... Um, price this in Priceline and they were like $20. I got mine for 8 bucks. I should have bought another one but yeah I was pretty pretty excited to get that so this one I'm definitely now going to try out now I've done this video because I've been waiting to do this video. Um, so the next place I went to was called Crown. Now I have used that, seen you guys on them before and I did get this I don't know if it's still valid or not but it is a discount code. Um, I will put the code down below for you guys if you want to go and try them. Um, so it is for a discount of an extra 10% off your next online order. And it is $30 off. Um, $30 order is a minimum. Um, but it doesn't say that there is a finishing date so I'll pop that one in the information down below for you so the thing that I got from there which I'm so excited now I can now use 
is this bad boy. So it is the Crown Brush 28 Color Neutral Eyeshadow Palette. So that is what it looks like. Now this cost me 20 bucks. Now I do love their um, their brushes, so I was excited to try this. So this is what the packaging looks like. Just plain black when you take it out of the box. And if I can open it and show you guys, because these colors are gorgeous. Put the plastic back on because I do not want these wrecked yet because I haven't even worn them. So, that are the colors there, guys. Like, how gorgeous are these? I wear a lot of neutrals, so I'm very happy with this palette. I'm excited to try like these colors because I haven't actually worn something like these ones before on this side. Um, or like, oops, sorry, that one there. I might take this off. There we go. Now you can see them. They're just gorgeous colors. There's some in there, like all, all all these top ones are matte, and then all the bottom ones are mixed between a matte. I really want to use this one. So yes, this was twenty bucks for this palette. I'm super excited to use this now. I may even do a review on them for you guys if you like. Um. So the next place we went to which I don't have here with me, um, is I went to a place and got a pen razor. So the pen razor is just like a pen, literally looks like a pen, but it has a, like a little cutthroat razor blade in it so that we can do tracks and things like that. I am currently practicing at work to see if I can maneuver this thing to use. It's, it's planning, it's coming out, it's all right, becoming a bit, oh, throwing things. Becoming a bit hard, but I am trying. Um, but yes, I don't have it with me to show you guys because I did leave it behind at work today, not thinking I was going to actually get off my behind and film this. So yes, that is one thing I haven't got here. Um, so the next place we went to, which was called, I think the brand is Bedhead because that's what it says on this bottle. Um, and I got a freebie from them. So this was is their mini masterpiece hairspray I haven't actually used these before but I've heard that bedhead is good this smells oh my gosh it doesn't say what it actually is fragranted this smells like tutti frutti you know that tutti frutti smell like lollies this smells like that so I'm actually going to give this a go. I'm going to go and put it in my shower and give it a go. I get this for free, so it's obviously their... It's obviously their, like, sample, so I got that. And then the second last thing I will show you, I got from another place as well, which was like a Salon Depot place sort of place. I got these clips, they are so cute, they were like $8, I did not care how much they were because as you can see, they are rose gold and I absolutely love rose gold. So I got these clips, they're just the normal alligator clips, um, and yeah, I think they were like 8 bucks. but I seriously, I saw them in the shop and I was like, you are coming into my life because you, these will now, they literally put my set together, I'm missing one thing that's in rose gold now and I will be onto that very shortly. Um, and you will see why in a minute, but yeah, so I got those as well to go with my kit because I'm kind of revamping my hairdressing kit at the moment. So the next last thing I got bought from Hair Expo, which I will show you, is I went to a stand called Eye Candy. Now, Eye Candy do scissors, um, so I bought myself some new scissors. So they came in these boxes here, so I got myself a pair of scissors and a pair of thinners, so two different things and I'm right-handed so I got two right-handed so also part of what I got this is what they actually come in so this is the case and as you can see it says eye candy so I will open these up and you will see why they are eye candy so these are my beautiful new scissors I'm going as you can see, they are rose gold with a pink detail and I have actually put some inserts in the scissors which are purple. So, 
Also part of that, I got a razor as well, which I got pink because obviously it's pink. Um, and then, yeah, so then you've got, got your excess in it, um, inserts and stuff in there. But that's them there. They are so beautiful. I'm not even going to take them out of the case because you will not see them or even see the beautiful colour. But so, yeah, so I got scissors and thinners. Um, I got all of this for, and this is... Hairdressing is so expensive, it's ridiculous, but these were all just under $500 for all of these. So I'm very, very happy with my new scissors. So that is the last thing that I bought at Hair Expo. So the other thing that we got given at Hair Expo when we were there is this book. So it's just a guide, as you can see, event guide. So in it and on the other side is a lookbook. So in this book is all the pictures of all the people that entered into hair expo awards and things like that um and also all about the on the other side um it tells you about all the different things that were on while we were there but this side is my favorite because you can see all the pictures of people's different work and things that they entered into the competitions and who they are where they're from all those sorts of things so yeah, that was something that we got given when we walked in at Expo. Um, but yeah, so that is pretty much everything I got at Hair Expo. So if you're still watching this video, thumbs up to you because this is a really long video. Um, so yeah, if you everything I got at Expo was all for work. I didn't really buy too much that was play, um, apart from the makeup because I just wanted new makeup. Um, so yes, I didn't really buy much for myself apart from that. Um, and yeah, so that's everything I got at Hair Expo. If you like these type of haul videos and this sort of stuff about hair dressing and things like that, please give this video a thumbs up. Um, and if you haven't been to my channel before, please like, the, um, hit the subscribe button so you can check out all my other videos because I am starting to become more regular on my channel and I am doing more vlogs and I do have some more of these videos I need to film. So, um, yeah, if you do, please, yeah, like that subscribe button and, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.